Hello everybody, my name is BDF 18 and welcome back to the LEGO Technic building series today. Product 4210 to the Mini Class Zerion. This is a funky looking set and I do like the look of this. There is a big Class Zerion, but they're like half a grand. There are two of these, so one of these coming next week as well, which is the Harvester. Another small set as well. Now I do like my mini sets, I've got the dump truck. I've got the motorcycle, the telehandler. I've got a few small sets. So this is going to add to it. This is part of the 2020 set. Let's flip down and have a look. So here is our little class Zerion, our mini set. This is a 130 piece set. So it's a pretty small one. On the top here, we have a one to one of the tire and wheel. On the side, the two in one with the vehicle. On the bottom, legal stuff. On the side here, legal stuff. And on the back, the harvester, two in one conversion and another image, small image of the mini class Zerion. This set cost me £10. I bought it actually a Facebook marketplace and I bought another set which will be coming in the next couple of weeks. I do like this. This is actually worth £20 right now as it is a retired. I got it for half price in cash in perfect condition. So thank you to you. Uh, for letting me take those off your hands. I'll happily have them because it goes into a video and that does well for me. As I mentioned, this is a 130 piece set. This is over 54 steps. So divide 130 by 54 and you get roughly 2.4 pieces on average per section for this build, give or take with the spares. Let's open this box then and get to the contents. Okay, this hits everything for product 42102, LEGO Technics Mini Class Zerion. Klaus, class, I don't know, with the two bags, a sticker sheet with four numbered stickers, and our teeny tiny instruction manual.
And here we go, as you follow and complete build for product 42102 Lego Technics Mini Class Klaus Zerion. And I do like this. It's a very, very easy build. And you know what? It looks really cool and it has moving parts. Obviously, you have your steering mechanism. Dead, 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 dead. But you also got this which turns your big, what are these, like, sweepers at the back? Is this meant to be, is this meant to be a road sweeper? I don't know, I don't know my farming. My father does, but I don't. One thing I have noticed is that this thing will not turn when you're going backwards, look. It will turn when you're going forwards. Then when you go backwards, it doesn't want to turn. It doesn't want to turn, but then when you're going forwards, it will turn. Maybe that's the intention, or maybe I screwed up. It's probably the intention, because I don't think I've screwed up at all. Really. Only three spare parts for the 130 allotted pieces. So there's 127 of 130 on here. I do like it for a price of £10. This is very nice. I recommend this. It's literally took me about 25 to 30 minutes to build, uh, give or take, looking for pieces as well. It's very simple. I had no trouble at all building it. No faults. Nothing went wrong at all. It has gone absolutely perfectly, and I'm well happy with it. I forgot to mention, you can also fold this up very slightly. If you want this on or off, you can fold it up and down very slightly. And this front bit here moves ever so slightly, but it doesn't really stick in place when you move it. Overall, a good build, a good set, and I look forward to building the Harvester next week. I do like these little mini sets, they tend to move quite a bit, sometimes even more than the bigger sets. This is very cool. I look forward to building the Harvester and showing you all soon. Let me know your thoughts on this build in the comment section down below. As always, leave a like, subscribe if you're new. Would you build a set? Would you buy it? Are you interested in it? Let me know and I'll send you a link to where you can get it from for a good price today. With that said, I've been BDF018. Thank you all so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next build. Take care.